Hollow. And hello, thank you so much for joining me today. If you're wondering why these dots are on my face, it's because the blinds here in America suck. You know, they're not like German blinds that like do all that fancy stuff and go and close it out and make the room perfectly black. I have my blinds closed, but you still get these dots coming in through. It's pretty annoying. Anyway. Today I'm going to be reacting to McDonald's USA vs. Germany. Honestly, I've been looking for a video like this for forever, and I think I finally found it. By Mex... I don't know how to pronounce that. Meses... I don't know. Gott. Go check out his channel, link down below. I'm very excited. I mean, I love McDonald's, I'm not going to lie. I know that's stereotypical for an American, but I do. And so I'm super interested to see what kind of different... I mean, right off the bat. Pizza and pasta. No way. Die 15 größten Unterschiede zwischen einem... We don't have either of those. ...deutschen und einem amerikanischen McDonald's. And I've got the subtitles turned on, okay? And it, it, luckily, he's speaking pretty clear, so I think the subtitles are working good. Seht ihr nach dem Intro. Whoa. Fancy machine. I've seen that in other countries where the McFlurries come in this weird container. A pretty cool container, but it's nothing like here in America. Ours are like, you know, it has a lid, and I don't understand how you mix them up because we use... I, I used to work at McDonald's, and you put the lid on the McFlurry, then you put the special spoon in that mixes it, and connect it to the machine, and it blends it all up. It goes crazy in there. So I don't know exactly what your process is. And <laughs> interviewing Sie Ronald. Psst, auch Where's du McDonald's. Video? Dann abonniere zu meinen wunderbaren Kanal, um keine neuen Infos mehr über McDonald's zu verpassen. McDonald's stammt zwar aus den USA, dennoch gibt es in Deutschland einige Unterschiede, okay, die man so in den Staaten yes. nie finden würde. 15 von diesen Unterschieden, die gibt es jetzt. Der McWrap bei uns in Deutschland. Oh, the McWrap. This actually makes me kind of mad because here in America they used to they used to have the snack wrap. McDonald's snack wrap. It was amazing. I mean, it was, no other words can describe it. It was wonderful. It was amazing. It was just a chicken wrap. It was like a dollar. It tasted great. Why they got rid of it, Lord knows. No idea. I mean, there's like campaigns here in America to bring it back, and they have not. But you guys get it, huh? And you've got a fancier tortilla. Seit Jahren zu finden, in den USA jedoch, da gibt es ihnen tatsächlich nicht. Lediglich einen ähnlichen Sausage Burrito, der mit Ei gefüllt ist. Den kann man dort zum Frühstück kaufen. That is not the same, you know? Chicken Nuggets. Although I'm surprised, do you guys not have the Sausage Burrito? I mean, Sausage Burrito, you guys love Sausage. Nuggets. In beiden Ländern zwar zu finden, jedoch Frühstück kaufen. Chicken Nuggets. In beiden Ländern zwar for breakfast? zu finden, Chicken Nuggets jedoch gibt es zusätzlich in Deutschland auch die Chicken Filet Tender. Whoa! This is like actual chicken. Once again, what the heck? McDonald's is an American company and you guys get the better food. How does that make sense? I mean, this is real chicken. You can see the fibers in it. It's not like uh, the pink slime they used to make McNuggets out of. <laughs> That's not fair. Das. And you get the tiny popcorn chicken too. Und manchmal auch die Chicken Wings. In den Staaten gibt es meistens nur chicken die normalen Wings? Chicken Nuggets. Salate. In Deutschland sehr beliebt bietet McDonald's gleich zwei Salate. Nugget Sandwich? I mean, Salad. I don't know why I said sa Sandwich. This is kind of weird because they're using the McNuggets chicken. You would think for a salad, which most, like, adults would order they'd be chopping up the good chicken <laughs> but this is filled with mcnuggets okay I, i'll pass on that in america jedoch not that the mcnuggets are bad i mean i'm gonna be honest they taste great but if you're trying to be healthy and eat a salad why would you want 
McNuggets chopped up in it. Da gibt es keinen einzigen. Anfang 2020 wurden Salate bei McDonald's in den USA abgeschafft und seitdem vermisst sie. Oh, they don't even bother with the salads here in America anymore. I'm not surprised. Nobody in America goes to McDonald's for a salad. Auch keiner. Genauso erstaunlich. In Deutschland, da regen sich die Leute auf, dass es nur zwei vegane Burger gibt. Nun gut, seid froh, dass es There's only two vegan options. überhaupt welche gibt in den USA, nämlich da gibt es keinen einzigen veganen Burger. Wer also vegan? <lacht> There's no vegan option. I feel like vegans. I don't know if they're the same in Germany, but vegans here in America typically are very particular. Like they don't even want the same utensils or the same gloves that have handled meat to touch their food. So preparing that type of food is really difficult. And I feel like the vegans wouldn't want it anyway, because it's inevitably touched something that touched meat. Dann in den USA a lot of leben möchte und zu McDonald's gehen will, der hat es deutlich schwerer. Kommen wir aber mal zu etwas Positiven. In den Staaten, da okay. gibt es neben den normalen Restaurants auch für Kinder sogenannte Entertainment Restaurants. Mit you guys don't have this? Oh, you know what? I bet these would be amazing in Germany, because you guys have the craziest playgrounds for children. I would have been fascinated to see a McDonald's play center, but you don't have them? This one actually does look kind of crazy. I would, this is what I would think the German one would look like. Like, what is this? You just climb on the outside of that? That is super dangerous. Mit einer Spielhalle und einem Rutschenparadies. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. This is, this is really next level. I've never seen a McDonald's with this in it. Just the jungle gym stuff. This is ridiculous. Ich glaube, wenn ich dort ein Kind wäre, ich würde nur noch zu McDonald's wollen. McDonald's in den USA ist. Yeah, kids have uh, their birthdays at McDonald's here in America. Very common. Very common. I would say it's more common among like lower class people because it's a cheap place to have your kids birthday but the kids love it. Ist <laughs> keineswegs gesünder. Viele Produkte enthalten deutlich mehr Inhaltsstoffe als in Deutschland oder Europa mm. und sind zudem auch um einiges größer. Während bei uns die große Cola 0,5 Liter groß ist. The large coal is 0.5 meters uh, liters. I assume he means Coke. Or I assume he said Coke and the translation is wrong. Uh, anyway, 0.5 liters is that big? I mean, we do sell two liters of Coke, so I'm thinking a quarter of a two liter. Yeah, that's a lot of Coke. Ist sie in den USA fast doppelt so groß. Was aber wirklich richtig cool ist, in den USA bei McDonald's, da gibt es Slush Eis. Yeah, yeah, nobody buys these though. I've never seen anyone drink this. They do look good. Außerdem gibt es deutlich mehr Frühstücksangebote als in Deutschland. Oh, McDonald's breakfast is amazing. If they don't have the big Außerdem breakfast gibt es deutlich mehr Germany, Frühstücksangebote als in Deutschland. Right here, the big breakfast with hotcakes. I'm sorry, because that's only like three dollars, or at least it used to be. I haven't got it in a couple of years. It's probably nineteen dollars now. Dafür aber nicht den bekannten Ananas Mango Smoothie. Den gibt es nur in Deutschland. Zu den Burgern. Pineapple. Movie? Das hat mich wirklich überrascht. Mehr Auswahl an Burgern. Die gibt es in Deutschland. Und jetzt werde ich mir ganz viele Feine machen. I need to see the pictures, man. The, the captions are pretty good, but it keeps calling things citizens. Mehr Auswahl an Burgern. Die gibt es in Deutschland. Und jetzt werde ich mir ganz viele Feine machen. Es gibt keinen McRib in den USA. Yeah, the McRib only comes back every, I don't know, every couple of years. Maybe once a year for a a couple months. I don't know how they do it. They have some kind of formula up there at McDonald's headquarters where they figured out, you know, if they bring it back once a year, it sells better or something. It's always coming back and leaving. Ich mag diesen Burger überhaupt nicht. Ich weiß, viele von euch, die lieben... I wonder what word is being mistranslated to citizen so commonly in this video. He is saying something that it's not the word citizen, but it keeps saying. Grip in den USA. Ich mag diesen Burger überhaupt nicht. Ich weiß, viele von euch, die lieben diesen Burger abgöttisch.
Deswegen bitte nicht haten, aber ich bin kein Fan von diesem Burger. Die Signature-Produkte. Diese... What the heck was that? Bitte nicht haten, aber ich bin kein Fan von diesem Burger. Die Signature... Okay. It's kind of funny, he was talking about how <laughs> in America we have bigger uh, portions. And now he shows this thing in Germany. What a monstrosity. A thousand calories in this one burger. What? Okay, it's a surf and turf, so that means it's fish and beef. And then also bacon? Produkte. Diese gibt es in den USA auch nur selten bei McDonald's. Während sie bei uns inzwischen Standard geworden sind. Und während es zur Zeit... I can't believe Germans eat that. Props to you guys. That's impressive. In Deutschland 17 verschiedene Gebäckarten Whoa. gibt. Kommen die Staaten gerade mal auf drei. Und zu guter Letzt... You got a lot more bakery stuff. You got donuts? You got any Berliners? Oh, you got muffins, cake. Gebäckarten gibt. Croissant. Kommen die Staaten gerade mal auf drei. Und zu guter Letzt in Deutschland. Da hat vor kurzem Deutschlands erster Doppeldorf in eröffnet. In den Staaten. The first double dolphin opened recently. Double drive through. What? Okay, this was two years ago. Yeah, we've had double drive throughs for. Oh my gosh. I feel like we've had them for like at least eight years. Jedoch, da gibt es schon über hunderte von diesen Doppeldrive-Ins. Diese waren also already, uh, over a hundred in Germany and they just started. Wirklich schneller wie wir. Ich finde so ein typischer US McDonald's ist wie unser von damals eben das normale Angebot ohne die ganzen extra Sachen. Und ich hoffe, euch hat dieses wunderbare Video gefallen. Ich wünsche Oh man, the translation is struggling here. Ich euch noch einen big tastischen Tag und bis bald. Uh, you too, man. I have no idea what you just said, but I thank you and you too. That was a great video. I don't know why it's got any thumbs down. Let me go to the comments. On the subject of McRib, and I already talked about that. I celebrate how the USA just doesn't have a standard McRib. Oh, everybody just wants to talk about the McRib. In this video, I'm currently eating... <laughs> Two double cheeseburgers, two McChickens, one chicken burger. Oh my God. Try not to have a heart attack. That was a great video. Go check out his channel, link down below. I love looking at McDonald's in other countries. I just think it's fascinating. Um, and honestly, I don't know why, but somehow your McDonald's looks better, which is not fair. But it is what it is. At least we got the better breakfast here in America. If you ever come to America, you got to try the McDonald's breakfast. Not sponsored. Mostly just because of how cheap it is. That really is part of what I love about it. Anyway, you guys are great. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for watching.